Disney's not gonna try, why should I? Maleficent, Mistress of Evil, the latest Disney live action remake to be released. And... It's not good. It is really not. This movie takes place five years after the events that take place in the first Maleficent film. Um, continuing this idea that Maleficent is truly the hero of the story and not the villain. The personal problem that I have is that you could tell who the villain of this movie is within the first five seconds. I don't care how the trailers make it out. The trailers make it seem like Maleficent might actually be the bad guy. But no, the movie has zero pretexts of who the true villain of the film is. I'm not going to get into it here. I'm going to make a rant video about that. But this movie, it feels so rushed. When the movie starts, there you, you see these characters that you don't know who they are, you don't know why you should care about them, and you don't know what they're doing. As soon as you see what you, they are doing, you know exactly what's going to happen to them. And I hate that predictability. I really don't like the Disney Live Action remakes, if you can't tell. I want Disney to get back to its original storytelling. Please take the risks again. Back at hand, the movie feels rushed, but it also it doesn't give you a reason to actually care about any of the characters at all. A movie should make me care about its main character and any of the supporting cast, but this movie doesn't. It relies on you knowing the original source material, aka the original Sleeping Beauty film, and the last Maleficent movie to try and get you to care about its characters. And it doesn't work. I don't care at all about any of them. At all. There actually is one little thing that I did like. The CG it seems to be a little bit better from the first one. Um, a lot of the fae folk, they seem to... Uh, they look better, they move more naturally, um, and I, I personally enjoyed that. They, um, good CG is something that I always personally enjoy seeing. The fairies still look like shit, though. They don't. No. You remember how unsettling they were in the first one? Yeah, just as bad. Except they're that way for the entire film. Uh, there wasn't anything to keep me invested in this movie, like, at all. Like, if you've seen the trailer, you know that Maleficent meets her other folk. But, she meets her other folk, comes back to do a thing real quick, goes back, and then they start a war. It just, like, the pacing is so off in this movie. Can we please get a movie where the characters do a thing and then it's paced well throughout the entire runtime? <sighs> Apparently not with these remakes. For me, this movie rules an eight. I can't even just, I can't enjoy it. I can't. Pacing was awful. Characters make no goddamn sense in whatever the fuck they do. And just, there were just so many better things I could have watched. And it was just so poorly written. I didn't. I thought it was dumb. That's all I have for now, guys. Please like, consider subscribing if you feel inclined. If you would like to, links to my Twitter and Instagram are going to be in the description down below, as always. And that's all I really have for now, guys. Peace out.